Hello, welcome to another episode of Commander Fodder. So, today our Commander Fodder is a theme deck from Betrayers of Kamigawa. And uh, let's have a look and see what choices we have. If you've seen the uh, set musings episode, you'll sort of know which one I've chosen already. But I'm just going to go back through here so we can just get a feel for the uh, theme decks generally from the set. So, we've got this Dark Devotion theme deck, so it's a black red deck depends on demon spirits and ogres to worship them and um, it wouldn't be any surprise uh, to see that obviously because we're on the the small set here second set of the block we're going to be pulling in or wizards pulled in um, cards from the uh, from the large set from champions as well so the two rares are Heartless, oh dear, Haitsugu, I think that is, and Yukora the Prisoner. Most of these decks, uh, because there's just so many legends in the uh, in the set, in the well, in the block as a whole, I suspect that we're going to find that most of these decks do have legends in them. There's a a blue ninjutsu deck, so that's actually a mono blue ninjutsu deck. Even though um, ninjutsu was in in blue black, so we've got three ninjas of the deep powers. We have a ra oh sorry um, the the rares were Iguru the Still Wind and Tomorrow Azami's Familiar. Then we have a Rat's Net Desk is a black theme deck. Um, has Amazai's Jitte in it. And the rares are Patron of the Nizumi, which is a legendary creature, and Umazai was Jitte. And then there's a blue green Spirit Craft deck. And Spirit Crafts is, is a sort of catch all term that refers to abilities that trigger whenever you play a spirit or arcane spell. And as they point out here, the deck contains either spirits or arcane spells um, as its non land components. The rares are Kadama of the Center Tree and Oyobi who splits who split the heaven. Now, because we've got um, like I say, legends in here, I might what I'm what I've obviously um, focused on, or I'm being drawn towards doing, is picking one of the mono color decks um, to do that. Um, just that way I can use the legendary in it. Um, and it, that, that'll be, that, you know, makes it easy for my commander. So I'm going to do the rats. Now I'm going to do rat tribal. So here's the, here's the deck as it was as a theme deck. 60 cards, 24 swamps. Obviously there's multiple copies of many cards in here. We've got Umazai's Jitte in here. According to this, the deck cost of putting this deck together around $62 sorry 60, 67 I can't read now I'm having one of those mornings the mornings that I recorded these uh, this block of videos <laughs> and um, yeah so that that's the deck as is and now we've got to obviously make it so we can use it as commander fodder to you know appropriately seed for our algorithm so I've taken out multiple copies in here. Nothing's come up at the moment as being a problem. So there's no sort of red round it to imply that I can't play it. But as you can see, there's Patron of the Nizumi, one of that cycle of Nizumi, uh, one of that cycles of patrons that's in the uh, in the set in the um, Betrayers of Kamigawa set. 
Removal-wise, we have um, Hirobi's Whisper. We've got Rend Flesh. We've got some uh, Swamp Enchantment here. Uh, there's some um, Creature Enchantment, Auras. A couple of those. And then we've got some Arcane Spells. And then some non-arcane spells. Now we've got a number of sorceries, including Bifal. And then, at the moment, in our creature package, or creature seed, we've got nine creatures, of which the vast majority are rats. So the commander is five and two black to cast. It's a six six, and it has rat offering on it. So you may play this place card any time you play an instant or sacrifice. Play an instant by sacrificing a rat and paying the difference in mana cost between this and the sacrifice rat. Mana cost includes color. Whenever a permanent is put into an opponent's graveyard, that player loses one life. So let's see what sort of suggestions we get, because this is what the episode's all about, is handing the deck building responsibility, to some degree, over to the architect algorithm and see what interesting cards it pulls up. Sometimes things go a little wonky, but sometimes they go very well. So let's have a look and see what we can see. So it's suggesting a few, oh yeah, so let's just start with a few artifacts. Definitely want um, Monty's Monument in here. Yeah, that's cool. It's interesting, it's sort of, as well, you know, that keeps with that theme of um, using something else to help you cast. But, um, of course, here, we're going to choose rat, and that's plus two, plus two. We'll probably find we get quite a few tribally artifacty type things. Oh, yeah. Cage Sun, Charcoal Diamond. I suppose it depends on how crazy I want to go with artifacts. That'll probably come at the expense of my, um, my creatures. So many good things here we could... Oh, what the hell. Just stop there for the moment. What's that? Eleven artifacts. Yeah. Oh. oh, stop there. Okay. Creatures. So yeah, looks like we're going with rats or things that like rats like Ogre Slumlord which gives our rats death touch yeah this looks like a deck that's probably gonna easily build itself what's this you may say Burglar rat. All rats have fear. Cool. Whenever stronghold rat steals combat, each player discards a card. Yeah, 
that's keeping you in the theme. There is a like a discard theme in the in the deck. So we should run ah, yeah. Obviously we've got different um that's odd. That must be a different uh, set then, this one. I think these are in here. Oh yeah, because that's the, yeah, that's the plane chase one. That's why. Septigrass. Why not? Oh yeah, I do like that in mono black deck. And we might as well say we made mono black, but a bit like Gary. Oh yeah, I love this. This one's got to go in. This is my wife's favourite card. I don't know if I've told this story. So we, we did, this is years ago. Um, we did some oh, dollar armor. Um, get this right. So, yeah, the, there was a format on Magic the Gathering Online, um, a format of a sealed deck where you actually uh, only opened um, four pack, four boosters. Um, and um, so basically, you know, you and you built a 30 card deck. That was it. So, yeah, you opened the equivalent of four, four boosters, which is, what's that, 60, yeah, so four packs of 15. So that would be 60 cards. So you're opening 60 cards instead of 90, and you're building a 30 card deck instead of a 40 card deck. And my wife... Um, pulled I think three scribbling or some ridiculous amount because it was using the dollar armor repacks and you get weird clustering in those so you might you know open up one and find multiple or several of them if they're packs that consecutively in the box they have like multiple copies of some cards that were obviously not popular at the time and just were you know um, draft fodder after events or whatever and so, yeah, that, there were there were three of these on board, and basically exiling the top of my library, which it you know doesn't sound much, but in a thirty card deck when you've already driven, you've already drawn like seven cards in your opening hand, it was quite amusing. Um, yeah, and of course you got landfall on it as well. So yeah, that was uh, whenever I think of that, I always think of that game, okay, and I got us foil one of these. Um, my wife's got it on the um, on the court board in her, her library. Not pinned through it, I hasten to add. <laughs> Not pinned through the card, but uh, it's in a like a sleeve protector. Relentless rats. How are we doing? Oh, Blood Artist is in here. Yeah, I could get extort going because there is a bit of a um, do I wanna fact, that's probably too many creatures. Yeah. Oh in fact I've mistakenly added multiple copies. I was aiming for around a third of the deck. Slightly more here. I don't really want that many. Let me let me look back on there. There was a few at the end there where probably we don't need them.
yeah, it doesn't make any sense in the deck. It's only sense if you just. Ma I mean, I could just. Re the other possibility of this is to turn it into a rel rel relentless, relentless rats deck. I'm glad I rechecked that because I just clicked that without thinking. That does not belong in this deck. But if you are doing a relentless rat rats deck, then yeah, that would be good. Okay. Mm, that's fine. So six cards. Okay, let's um, let's have a look at some instants and sorceries. This is really just a deck with a lot of disposable creatures by the look of things. Worried. Taking its time. Make sure that's not busted. Looks oh. like we've got a failure to launch problem. Now, I'm just looking to see whether there's anything here I can cut back a little bit. I mean, I don't really know. Yeah, it's not really doing anything. I know it was in the original deck. Oh, we've got a connection issue again. What is going on today? That is annoying. <laughs> oh, hum. That's better. Very strange. So, what do we got left? Let's try again. taking its time so yeah I'm just looking for a few instant speed spot removal things I could probably just add these manually actually if it's going to be naughty like this my internet connection today is just appalling
talk amongst yourselves. This is one of the downsides of doing stuff like this where I choose not to edit. It's just as if I'm doing it literally live. Although I obviously delay the upload, but... Uh, strange. See if anything is working. I've got internet again, but it's just architect is playing up, and I don't know why. Let's just try reloading the deck. It's probably not a good idea, but never mind. I know there's been lots of internet issues recently because of the or website issues because of that um, problem with um, Apache web servers but I don't know if this that's specifically the problem here and that's better okay I'll have that please card draw Run a lily. Okay. Yep. Mass removal. Okay, so one more thing so I don't forget. here two more save boom okay so there we have the deck I'm going to export it so we don't get any further issues at least the problem seems to have stopped now since I've reloaded the deck so We should keep that, but what the heck? Get we get a net miser out. Oh, 
Oh, there's our second swamp. I don't think I want to put ragged veins on my... Uh, <laughs> yeah, so this really um, isn't not good when you're goldfishing. Not yet though. I could uh, rattle through my nap miser, but not quite yet. Okay, yeah, I should have never... I should have mulliganed. Oh, there we go. Okay, so I've got to discard as well if I can't play anything out here. Okay, we can play that. that's going to take off of there is uh, I think you're better off with one of these if you're going to do that so one takes her down to three and one black so four to cast if I make a rat one of these as a rat offering Six six in six six in play. So we would have five, six, seven. So yeah, we would have tapped out and offered um, this here. That point. So I say we just got rid of that. Yeah, this is not good. Oh, there's a swamp. And we would have had to have discard something as well. Let's just get rid of that. For the purposes of this. And now, okay, so now things start to get a little bit more interesting. We tap out, tap all of these. We've got our vanquishing banner out. 
next one have we got any creatures we can actually get out obviously we could potentially swing with this um, start putting uh, yeah we equip up this with this and start swinging in so we can't even cast this yet although this is going to make us draw we, yeah we're getting rid of a mess here let's just have a look at another hand that's better yeah so my mistake there was was keeping that hand Yeah, that's much better. Yeah, okay. That was just a bad hand. Yeah, that's better. Okay, good. Just so I know. So not too bad. Anyway, I've already extracted that. Sorry for all the trouble. It's been uh, putting these three back. Because what I normally do is I film the three episodes sort of back to back just because for time reasons I need to get everything done on a Monday and that's when they all get filmed. So unfortunately because I had um, seemed to have Wi-Fi problems today which has now gone away <coughs> um, it's affected all three of the videos in some way so sorry about that but hopefully that didn't uh, detract too much from the the episode so there we have the uh, the build for the commander for that episode where we're building it on the rats next the rats nest deck from betrayers of kamigawa thanks for watching and bye for now